Well, I truly don't know what went in my mind thinking, Hey, you know what? What happens if I do this? I I'm not fucking Omori. I'm still Sunny. This is still the real world. Like, come on now. That's just a certified retard moment for me. Well, I suppose there's nothing left for me to do other than my to-do list. Today your chores to organize your old belongings. Alright. Well, what do I do now? Reach into the large cardboard box. Picked up a small pinwheel. Oh, you're joking me. I have to put everything... Oh, my lord. Well, that was very fun and engaging. There's still a few things out of place, but that should be good enough for now. Well, I didn't really throw away a lot of things. Good boy. Hmm. The fuck do I hear? Also, not gonna lie, I maybe probably should have thrown away that singular puzzle piece. But I decided to keep it. Uh. Hold on there, chief. What the hell is going on here? What, are, what am I listening to? Am I just gonna have to go to sleep? Well, not really given much of an option to do anything. Well, I did what I could and there's nothing left for me to do. A bunch of somethings looking at me around everywhere. Don't know where that music was coming from. Okay, maybe we can bring back the music, you know? This doesn't seem... This doesn't seem like it's up my alley. Oh my. That's literally the reverse of what happened. Uh, I don't think we did a good thing here. Welcome to white space. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. Not a big fan of us just deleting Sunny from existence, I guess. Well, the light bulb's now fixed. I guess, if I can even call it that. What? Uh. Don't know why that's different. Fucking Mule is no longer here. My god, what have I done? A buddy over there is just waiting for me and I don't like it. Alright, bucko. What do you want me to do here? You learned red hands. Alright. White space looks just the same. What do I even do now? That's the real question. Hi right, guys. Uh, hi Amori. We were hoping that you'd come by soon. Oh, want to play cards with us? We we're just about to start another game. Oh, whoops. Never mind. Aw oh, man, what the heck, Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. Hold up. Why are we repeating the same thing from the beginning of the game? I was winning too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game after all. Don't give me that, hero! You only say that because you were losing! <laughs> yeah, why are we repeating the same things from before if we're still... Well, 50, I guess. Uh, what do we have over here? Red hands. 
deals big damage four times. I suppose I could change it for mock. I do have stare instead. That was always picking on me. Doesn't he have anything better to do? One day I'm gonna pour life jam all over his hair and see how he likes it. I don't recall the life jam part. Oh, Murray, I wanted to thank you for being my best friend. In return, here's a present from me to you. <sighs> now you spin your hand too. This is a brother's handshake. If you shake my hand now, then I'll dub you my honorary brother. Sure, I guess. Ew. Woohoo! That settles it! Now we're destined to be bros forever! And that makes Hero your honorary brother now, too! <laughs> What's up, Omori? We've been waiting for you. Kel and Aubrey have been fighting a lot again. You would think they'd get tired of it after a while, but they're just both so full of energy. Oh my god, you're giving me that bullshit from Black Space again, aren't you, Hero? Now what? Now what? Waiting for something to happen. I can't leave my my friends. What the fuck do I do now? <laughs> so, did you want to head out soon? Mari and Basil invite us for a picnic. Uh, guys, we already went through the picnic, have we not? Going out tomorrow. Here is your allowance for today. Six thousand clams. Oh, thanks, G. Thanks, G. I was going to say that we just reset the whole fucking world, but we didn't because everyone's still gone. Mari! Basil! Oh, hello, Aubrey. Hello, everyone. How are you all doing today? Kel's being mean to me again! Oh, no. Not again. How could he? Psh! I'm not being mean, Arby's just being all whiny. Well, Cal, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me! No, believe me! Ugh, settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about you. <laughs> Oh, come on, Mari. Not now. Oh, Hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. Did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Ah, uh, okay. But it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop downing yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. You're right, Aubrey. Sorry, I'll try to believe in myself more. Here, uh, this way we can all see. Everything looks the same. Wait, was- Hold up! Wasn't this the picture we took next to your house? Buddy! Wasn't it all blurry? <laughs> Wasn't it all fucking blurry? Oh, hey, Amori. Do you want to look at the photo too? Wow, that was hella blurry. <laughs> Not even any description of it. These photos are all so charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Mari likes to steal my camera sometime. Only sometimes. When I looked at these photos, I feel so lucky to have friends like you. Before I met you all, I only knew what it was like to be alone. But you've all taught me so much. How to care for others, and how to care for myself, too. Aw, Basil. You're so sweet. We all feel the same way about you. Yeah, we do anything for each other. No matter what happens, we've got each other's backs. Uh-oh, I'm feeling a group hug to coming. You know what, Hero? You're right. I think I do, too. Uh-huh. A group hug? Right now? I'll start! Hey, don't leave me and Mari out of this. Come on, you too, Amori. Get close in, everyone.
All right, now I know for damn sure this didn't happen in the beginning. For God, this group hug feels needed. Ah, that would have been a good photo. It's okay. We don't always need a picture. It's not just about the memories. It's about us. I know that we'll all be friends for a really long time. Ooh, Aubrey, do I have some news for you. We'll always be together, like one big happy family. Aww, you guys really are the best. I'll cherish you all forever. What the fuck do we do now? <laughs> what do we do now? Hey, Omori, thanks for always being there for me. Here's something I made for you. Got a flower crown. I hope it fits okay. I can always adjust it if it doesn't. I'll cherish you all forever. Aw, thanks, Basil. You can still go through your photo album over here. There's not much. I'm so grateful to have friends like you. I'll cherish you all forever. Now, I'm very curious. It's a rusty knife now. Getting a bit brown. A uh, flower crown, you said? A hundred heart? Plus 25 juice? Oh man, Basil, I would really love to take it, but this universal remote is just... I, I can't leave it behind, you know? I'm disgusted by how useful this rabbit foot has been ever since the beginning of the game. I could use the foxtail. Speed increases with more energy. I don't know why that gives me more speed all of a sudden when this thing gives me 15 speed. But I'm going to keep the rabbit foot just because of the luck as well. The luck has actually been really useful for critical hits. Yo, what the fuck do I do now? That's the real fucking question here. And also, might I just add that I feel like shit for not using the fucking flower crown. But I, I truly don't know on who, who I could put it. Actually, I could actually give it to Aubrey. But that gets rid of so much attack, actually. And defense. The only reason why I would give it to her is for the last resort, but... I don't really use the last resort now like I did in the first playthrough. So all the flowers are alive again. Even Basil's house is fine again. Whoa! You got a gladiolus hairband. Attack plus 10, luck plus 10. Increases hit rate. Okay. I'll take that. We got a cactus hair clip. Defense plus 15, heart plus 15. Mmm. Nah. Rabbit's foot all the way. A rose hair clip. Oh man, you're really gonna have to do something in order to, uh, <laughs> in order to get me to get rid of that top hat. Rose hair clip. Increases all stats. Holy shit. Oh, you know. The that is, a, that is a contender right there. That actually is a contender right there. The tulip hair stick. R plus 50 wear against more X. I, I don't need more XP. Are you joking me? This is actually better than the universal remote. I'll take it. That's um, some pretty good items I got there. But still though, the better question is, what the fuck do I do now? <laughs> now then. Pluto! What's up, my guy? Ah, it's a surprise to see you here, children. My dream of owning a transportation system has taken me all around the universe. But it's still nice to come back home every now and then. Sometimes I miss my friends. Like the Earth here. The Earth and I go way back. Before we were confined to this solar system. We soared through galaxy after galaxy, decimating everything in our own path. I still think very fondly of those times. Oh, the Earth can talk. What's that, Earth? Hmm, I see. The Earth tells me that she has been keeping watch on your journey. She says that your growth has inspired her and that she wishes to challenge you to a battle. Our last battle was cut short, but perhaps we can finish it now. What do you say? You're damn right, Pluto! <laughs> then the Earth and I shall team up once again. 
Prepare yourselves, children. Victory will not come easy. Holy shit. This will be our final fight. Show me everything you have. The Earth and expanded Paluto. My lord. Actually, I'm gonna be real with you guys and say that I maybe don't got this. Uh, let's just stare at fucking Pluto over here. What do we need? Air horn, air horn, air horn. Flex. Kel, I'm gonna need you to flex. Not flex, I'm gonna need you, Kel. No, that's not it. And, uh, air horn. Flex! Alright, there goes Pluto. Uh. Everyone feels sad. Buddy! What the fuck was that? Impressive progress, young Kel. Your flex has improved greatly. Uh, can we give uh Pluto another bit of a stare over here? Uh, sparkler, sparkler, sparkler towards young Kel over here. Kel, you need. SOMETHING to heal you up! Here, have some ramen. And... Hero, I'm gonna need you to use a... Wait a minute, did I give the sparkler to Kel? I feel like I'm- I feel like I'm an idiot over here. I never realize what kind of shit I give to- what, what kind of shit I give to my friends. Alright, sparkler... I swear to god, if the earth makes me sad again, I'm gonna be upset! Loser! You miss! You miss! Ha <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. I am actually going to do this. This is what I'm gonna do. Present on my boy Pluto. Aubrey, I am also going to need you to give a present to my boy, Omori. Kel, what were you supposed to do again? I already fucking forgot. Oh yeah, I'll give. I'll just give the present to the earth. That's right, that's right. And uh, good old snack time. I just hope that nothing fucks up. Oh, he's already angry. I didn't even realize. And I fucked up. DUDE! God, why is this so hard just to fucking prepare everything? Oh my god! Okay, okay, okay. Where is the stupid combo meal? Combo meal, combo meal. There we go, combo meal. I'm gonna have to get rid of the earth first. Ouch. Kill's almost about to die again. Fuck. Fucking hell, man. Ouch! Okay, just fucking attack the earth at this point in time. God, I I do I do all of this shit only just to only just to get shit on again. Come on! Fuck this! I'm using the snow cone. All right, come on, Amori, get rid of the earth. Fuck the earth. Fuck the earth. Let's go! This only does a thousand damage, which sucks. In what world does a thousand damage suck? Apparently this one! You missed! Haha! -ha. Loser! Loser! I could go with red hands, but no, 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 no. Final strike. Wait a minute, final strike goes with everyone? Holy shit, it does. Beat down on the earth! Kel, running on the earth, hero, snack time for everyone. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for, baby. This entire time I wanted to do that. That's what I did the the Robo Heart as well. Snack time. 
Ouch! Pluto is almost dead. Let's try Red Hands. Uh, can we get a little bit of a beatdown as well? Cal, I'm gonna need you to FLEX! And Hero, I'm gonna need you to give this... Give what, give what? Give a cheeseburger to Aubrey. FLEX! Holy shit. Oh! And that still doesn't kill Pluto. That still doesn't kill Pluto! My lord! He really is the strongest planet in all the cosmos! Ah, oh, it seems I have underestimated you once again. Very few have pushed me this far, and none have left the same. I want nothing more than victory! Let me show you my resolve! Begins charging his ultimate attack. Shite, 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 shite. Uh, 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 um. Oh, well, he's just gonna be dead, isn't he? I'm glad to have met each of you and watch you all grow. <laughs> Unbelievable. Even at full power, I have been bested. It has been an honor to do battle with you. Your victory is well deserved. Yeah, no kidding. At what cost though? At what fucking cost? It seems that the student has surpassed the teacher. I always knew this day would come, but perhaps not so soon. Thank you for humbling us children. Our time in the universe doesn't last forever. Even at my age, it is important to continue to learn and grow. Yes, that is what it means to be alive! Go forth, children, and shine as bright as the stars in the galaxy. There are many that believe in you, more than you know. Oh, thanks, Pluto. I can't believe I still ended up having to beat the absolute living shit out of you, but you know what? Alright, buddy, I didn't want to fight you, but you pushed me to my limits. I was gonna be, I was gonna be over here trying to commend Pluto and whatnot, but your bitch ass decided to show up out of nowhere. All right, we are back here because I still have no fucking clue how to get these batteries. The G key has to be here. It just has to be. You know, maybe I should have realized if Pluto was angry or happy because if he was happy, because if I if I realized he was angry, I could have just made everyone fucking happy oh uh hello bah where has that boy run off to now i warned him that that sweetheart girl would bring nothing but trouble have you seen my son his name is captain space boy but i'm not sure what he goes by nowadays there's always something going on with that bird brain space pirate chief my most trusted advisor well, did you find him? Squirrel, it's looking a little grim, Captain. Squirrel, he may be gone for good this time. But, I did find these, Squirrel. Batteries? Huh? What's this? Batteries? I asked you to find my son, and you brought me batteries? This won't help me find Captain Space Boy. Uh, do you know, do you need those batteries? Hmm, or will it? Squirrel, sorry, Captain. I'll keep looking, Squirrel. Even if he is in a pain in the butt sometimes, Squirrel. I'll take the batteries. Batteries, 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 batteries. Please tell me. Let's go. All right. Really? That was that didn't fucking open this shit at all. My brother in Christ! I looked all for these batteries for you, just for you to uh, cog block me from getting in here. Oh. Need to wait for it to be over. 
All right, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Leave this place. <laughs> Sign S X H. They're all cold lanterns, but okay. I <gasps> let's go. <laughs> Holy shit! After all this time, we found the G key. <laughs> We found the G key! Even though it wasn't the right fucking key, but we found it nonetheless! Oh, my life feels empty right now. <laughs> I should be working on an essay right fucking now, but... Oh well. How does a penguin build a house? It glues it together. Excellent! Don't understand why I need to record it in my joke book, but but you know what? Whatever. Holy shit! Turn back while you still can. S X H. Snow globe mountain, a. Eh? Seems pretty chilly. From the looks of it. I see melons. Melons that I need to collect. Oh, come on now. Where the fuck am I? Can you, can you please zoom in the camera closer on me? A little bit more faster. Por favor. Yes, thank you very much. You find yourself at the foot of a mountain. There's nothing over here, right? No, I just ring around clockwise. Like an asshole. There's a cave in there. I just want to see if there's any melons around. There's a snow bunny. I'll gladly get rid of it right away. No, now that I just realized, with my newfound equipment, I'm pretty much... I could pretty much just make everyone happy and I wouldn't be whiffing because of the hit rate. Whoa. Tenderizer? Hero learned tenderize. What the fuck? The most dangerous tool in the kitchen. Holy! It's quite a lot of attack! Must feel like I should use it. Deals big damage to a foe and reduces their defense. Oh, well shit, bro. Now you're telling me this. I already have you as a support guy, Hero. I don't need more attackers. Genuinely. All right, I'm up here now. I'll look at that ladder a little later. There's two stairs? Two sets of stairs? Hello? Uh, hello? Who are you? A snow pile. Holy. Okay, that's not a lot of XP. So in theory, you should have very, very low HP then. I'll go up the ladder. Life jam! You got a snowball. God, I'm just getting a lot more equipment now, aren't I? It is cold because it is made of snow. I think I'm gonna be sticking with my chicken ball. Uh, what does... what does the other thing do? Snowball. Make a foe sad, also deals big damage to sad foes. I'd rather not. Even throughout my second playthrough, I still have not found that great of a use to become fucking sad. Oh, would you look at that? I was wondering what that crack was. I was like, you know what? I'll just stand on it for a bit. What would, what would it do? Nothing bad will happen, right? And I just fall through. Oh, that is a lot more cracks than, I, than, I, than I'd like to see. Alive. What? I did a full turn of attacks on him, and he's still not dead. God, as soon as I say that, I don't, I don't find a fucking use to be sad. Here, this guy, this dipshit, decides to show up and be like, "Oh, well, you, you see, if you're sad, and then you have a bo uh, boatload of defense now, all of a sudden." Uh, what is that? Feel a little better than before. 
cool, I guess. Thanks. Just a quick little picnic, I guess. Where am I supposed to go? There's nothing for you here. Be gone. Signed SXH. And so if I go up the ladder, that's uh, another crack that I do not want to deal with. Snow cone ticket. I'll gladly accept that. Speak of the devil. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There wasn't any snow where I grew up, but it still makes me miss being a kid again. I wonder why that is. Because snow is just awesome, bro. Yeah, snow snow is pretty dope, not gonna lie. Ah, fuck! Look, it doesn't snow very often where I am, but when it does snow, you know, it just feels... Well, it doesn't feel great for the city, I can tell you that. Traffic, <laughs> traffic just becomes an absolute nightmare, but for the most part... It's actually pretty dope, you know, when you're when you're able to see snow when you usually don't when you're usually not able to. Alrighty then, pineapple juice. What do we have over here? A good old. Is that just snow cones? No, that's shaved ice. I, <laughs> I was about to say, Mario, ain't no way you have an entire picnic worth of snow cones. Wow! Isn't this snowfall pretty? I mean, I guess it's pretty. Snow is fine once in a while, but I never live anywhere that snows all the time. Think of all the shoveling. Oh, Basil. Hey, Basil, are you okay? Huh? Oh, it's nothing. Sorry, it's kind of silly. I don't know why, but snow makes me really sad. Aw, don't be sad, Basil. We're all here for you. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's okay to be sad sometimes, but you can always confide in us. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Uh, don't worry. I know I can always tell you guys anything. Hmm, really? That's not what the real world says. You look into the snow globe, you see some kids sledding down a steep hill. They look like they're having fun. Dope. Hello. Babo like cold time. Make Babo grateful for warm time. That That's a way for putting it. That's a way to put it. The more cold you experience, the more grateful you become of the warmth. Because let me tell you right now, I do not like the warmth at all. Because it's always too much. Way too much. Ah, would you look at that? Pluto space line. Look into the snow globe, you see a car stuck in the snow. Some kids are drawing on the fog of the back seat window. Or whatever it said. I don't know, because I accidentally mashed A. Don't come looking for me. Only the cold can keep me company now. Signed S S signed S X H. You see a small house at the top of a snow-covered hill. It looks warm inside. Right, that must be where Space Boyfriend, Captain Space Boy, whatever, is in. There's just a random bench over there. Mirror! I love me and my friends. They'll never leave me alone. Oh, they'll never leave me behind. That's the better way for me putting it. Go away, leave me to my miserable existence. Signed, SXH. Would you look at here? A telescope. There's snow everywhere. That I'll be able to see anything else. Hey! The view is pretty nice. Would you look at that? Go over here, go over here, over here, over here, over here. Boom. Easy. And not only that, but I get more jam packets. Let's go! Thank you very much. Man, I kind of wish jam packets were sold. I don't care if they're going to be a, a more expensive than like a fucking snow cone. If I was able to buy jam packets, I would. Because jam packets are the only way how I'm able to use Last Resort as Aubrey and then be able to have her back again alive. God damn, I can't see anything over here. Uh, 
That doesn't look good. Uh, guys, let's kill them immediately. Kill the snow angels. In theory, they shouldn't do that much damage, right? They shouldn't kill me. Oh, everyone feels happy. Wow, you actually just messed up now. How is that a moving attack? What the hell? And you made him neutral! And I whiffed! Ow! What is it with you people? And how is this one angel not dead? Jesus! Come on, people! Can we stop missing for the love of God? I swear to God, if you hit Kel again... Bro! How is this moving attack? How is this a moving attack? I am not angry at all! I am happy! How is this a moving attack? Can somebody please tell me how? Oh my god, Kel's almost fucking dead. Wow, that just obliterated her. In an instant. I'm surprised at how much this is that these red hands are actually doing. Killer, killer, killer! No, she's not dead yet. How is she not dead? She's literally one! <laughs> okay, holy shit. These guys are done. Finito. My lord, that took way too fucking long. Alright. Ooh, melon. No cone ticket. I'm tempted now to look everywhere for more melons. On the combo meal. All right, that should be everything, right? Hmm. I don't know about these presents. I don't know about these presents. I'm just mashing buttons at this point in time. I don't know how I was able to make it through there, but I I was somehow. Oh no, this is just a this is just a flat out puzzle over here now, isn't it? Don't worry. By sheer brute force, something <laughs> something will eventually come to my favor. Nice snowman you got there. All right, buddy, can we please stop it with the fucking cutscenes over here? I just need to get all the way up there. Now, now, now. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It would be foolish to continue. How I wish someone had told me the same. Find SXH. I'll take a quick little picnic first of all. We're in the middle of a blizzard. Hooray! You've almost made it to the top. How are you all feeling? No worries, Mari. Yeah, we're just fine. Ah, uh, my ears are popping again. Kel, I told you already, it's the elevation. Yeah, stop complaining, Cal. We're all feeling it too. I'm not complaining. I kind of like it. It reminds me of when you finally get the water out of your ear after swimming. Ah, swimming, sun, heat. Hey, guys. Let's go somewhere warmer next time. Uh, from the looks of it, I don't think, I don't think we're having a great time over here. All is fair in love and war, but it still hurts when you lose. Signed, SXH. You will gain nothing from coming here, as did I. Of oh, this will be for naught. 
find SXH. <laughs> Space X husband. Okay, that's what I meant. Ah, what a surprise. It is you all. Hello. What a pleasant evening this is. Bro, are you the snowman? Uh, hey, it's uh, Captain Space X husband now, right? You don't look so hot. Yeah, it's so chilly up here. Are you, like, okay? Oh, me? Were I not children? My heart is frozen. I am pure. I am cold, like ice. I feel nothing. I will never feel anything ever again. Oh no. He's even worse than last time. Captain Spaceboy, uh, come on, let's bring you back home. Captain Spaceboy? Who's that? I am nothing. I am pure. I am cold, like ice. <sighs> He's never going to listen to us at this rate. What do we do? Isn't it obvious? We have to beat the snow out of him, just like last time. Come on, guys, we can do this. What? Are you sure? There must be another way! Ah, this cold. I can relate to it so well. It, it is slowly taking over my soul. I am becoming one with the ice. Hmm, normally I wouldn't agree with Kel's methods, but at this rate he's going to freeze all alone up here. Sometimes you need a little tough love. That's what I like to hear! Don't worry, Captain Space Boy, we'll save you! I uh, don't like that sound. I feel nothing. I am cold, like ice. Captain Space X husband, you say? <laughs> that's tough. That, that's honestly pretty tough, not gonna lie. Now that we just used the exact same method that we did to defeat Pluto. Except this time, hopefully we don't fuck up. Everyone's enraged now. The only person who really shouldn't be enraged is Kel, but you know what? That's fine. We'll just give him another stare. Aubrey, I'm gonna need you to give him a sparkler. Kel, my boy! My buddy old pal. Actually, no, 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 no. I need to give this present to Captain Space Boy. Space husband. Whatever. Sparkler to Kel. Another present to Omori and Sparkler to kill. Oh, he can't get. Oh, wait a minute. He can't feel emotion, can he? I should have seen this coming. All I have left are my memories, but even they cannot make me feel anymore. Alas, I see a memory before me. It's my sweetheart, but she's in the arms of another man. Uh, sorry, not sorry. Let's give him a good old beatdown. Kel, you run and gun at him. And hero! Cook for Aubrey! Five! Really? Five! I did all this for nothing! Oh, no. Looks like I can't defeat him through conventional methods. Uh, no one truly understands the depths of my pain. If I do not feel, then the pain can no longer reach me. If you cannot feel, then the pain won't reach you. Well, buddy, uh, let me tell you something. I have more than enough things to make you feel. Uh, let's see here. If that doesn't work, I'll just use the dandelion. He can't get any sadder, can't get any happier. He feels angry! He feels angry! Let's go! We made him feel something! Ow! Alas, I see a memory before me. It's my sweetheart, but she's throwing my things across the room. Oh, what do we do now? What? Am I just supposed to keep giving him, making him angry? Oh, fuck! I just realized Kill's now angry too! 
Damn it! Oh, let's just give him a good old stare. Hopefully that will do something. Okay, now I see what we're supposed to do. Now I see what we're supposed to do. Gah! How dare she treat me that way! Okay, that uh... That uh, didn't work as much as I wanted it to work, but you know what? I can't complain! We'll give him a good old sparkler. Release energy! Alright, the better question is, can I actually be able to crit with this thing? If I can, that'd be fucking amazing! No, I can't. Okay, please! Ouch! Okay, okay, okay. Uh... Final strike! Uh, beatdown! Running gun! And... Hero, please cook for Omori! <laughs> the pain. I can feel it. Okay. That was a little anticlimactic. See you soon, space husband. <laughs> oh, uh, Captain Space Boy, how are you feeling? Hey, I hope I'm not the first one to tell you this, but maybe it's about time you let go of sweetheart and started to enjoy the finer things in life. Yeah, you got better things to worry about, like your crew. You're a space pirate, for heaven's sake. My crew? Ah, uh, yes, my crew. I nearly forgot. How horrible of me. I must be so worried. I should go back to them. Here, take this. I won't be needing it anymore. Oh, I'll be off now. Don't worry about me. I'll find my way home. I know the way back. Oh my god, <laughs> really? Can you be bothered to take us back home with you? Alright, dickhead. Be like that. Well now, what does this wedding ring do? Increases all stats, wearer starts happy. God damn, that's actually terrible for my speed and my luck. It does make me start happy. Nah. <laughs>